They hide inside furniture or other objects. Can't tell just by looking. Over the years, we've developed technology to help us find ghosts. Let's start with the ghost sensing radar. Watch that dial. A high reading could mean a ghost is nearby. Not very accurate, but it's better than nothing. There's other gadgets. More on that later. Of course, finding the ghost is only... You'll need a weapon to finish the job. This is your spectral cannon. Standard issue anti-ghost weapon. Good. Fire again. Once more. Well done. Let's con... There's more weapons to choose from. More on that later. You'll have five minutes to destroy all ghosts in the area. If time runs out, the clock will strike midnight. Midnight is the ghostly hour. They become very powerful. If midnight strikes, the tables have turned. All destroyed ghosts return to life. They will want revenge. Your only hope is to survive until evac arrives. Stick with your team or try to hide. Either way, the odds are grim. So, don't let midnight happen. Get them all in the first five minutes. See that, huh? Pull out your radar. You see any reading? Looks like there's a ghost nearby. Could be this chair. Pull out your spectral cannon and let's find... Fire on this chair to see if there's a ghost inside. There's the ghost. Well done. That's one less ghost to worry about. Let's clean up this mess. Head over to the generator. At the generator, you can change your gear and heal. Let's try switching your radar for a vacuum. That's the ticket. You'll be doing that a lot. You can use this vacuum to clean up destroyed ghost shards. This will prevent them from being revived by an... Let's go vacuum up the shards of the ghost you just destroyed. Vacuum ghosts still return at midnight, but in a weakened state. I think we've covered the basics, recruit. But before you go on your first hunt, I urge you to try out more weapons. There's some target dummies set up for you. If you prefer to learn on the job, simply... Good luck, Hunter. We'll be watching.